Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, forgive us our sins. As we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hello. Show yourself. I know you are present. I know you've been watching me, filling my mind with thoughts, cruel thoughts. Ones of malice and corruption. You've shown me things all to stray me from the path of God's light. And now I declare to you, demon, that it shall not work. I said, show yourself, you foul thing. Greetings, my child. H how can I help you tonight? No, I'm sorry. <laughs> I have felt plagued by something recently. I just called upon the Lord to aid me in holding on to my faith. If it worked, <laughs> In time, I shall know. God does not reveal to us his answers when we want, but instead when he is needed. It takes no miracle to hold on to faith, my child. Just the knowledge that he is always with us may be enough to help any soul stay on the righteous path. Was there a reason you chose to visit the church this late? A confession? Uh, of course, come with me. Is something the matter? Why are you hesitant, my child? Of course, the Lord hears your confessions. Why does this doubt plague your mind? I see. May I tell you something? It is okay to hold doubt in your heart for the things you have done. Such is the nature of man. The Lord shall wash that away once you lay your sins at his feet, no matter how great they are. What have you done that makes you believe that you cannot be redeemed? Of course, that is for the confession. Step inside and I will be right with you. Alright, the Lord is present. Confess. What? My child, you, you can ask those questions after the confession. This is not about what plagues me, but instead, what burdens you? What do you mean? You said some time ago that you have committed sins that you believe prohibited your redemption. They do not burden you. Who? What are you? You. Why are you here? Do not play games with me, demon. Tell me your intent. 
Elias, you have filled my head with nothing but horrors and evil. Lies again. Those thoughts are not mine. They are but manifestations of your evil, attempting to stray me from God's path. What do you mean? The source of your manifestations do not concern me. They are tricks simply of your devilish nature. How, how did you know that? Clara's child is not my concern. I am only here to give her consolation. You do not know what you say. I said those are not my thoughts. The child was born of a mistake between herself and some cat's buffoon. What are you trying to say? I... Cease this nonsense! Be quiet, devil! Name, you foul thing. Do you not torture me enough? What are you saying? Blasphemy. It is blasphemy for you to enter a house of God and mock his power as though you are a force greater than he. You are not greater. Just Vile and delusional enough to think you hold a candle to the faith I have in the Lord. It stands as strong as I do. My sins do not dictate the measure of my belief. All sins are redeemable by the Father, even my own trespasses against Him. What of Clara? She'll be fine. I will. I, I can't. That is not true. She is only 17. She still has years ahead of her. Dear God. I my dog. Clara. me at all? No, you cannot. Do not lie to me, demon. You are not. You are not a demon. A, a prophet. But those thoughts, those were not mine. I do not think about bashing in the child's head. I do not want to kill Clara. It's okay. You are right. The only way to atone for such a sin is to ensure that Clara and the child will suffer for my actions. The sin is only as great as the havoc it wreaks, and I can rectify it. If they never suffer from my sins, then it shall be that I have never sinned. Yes, this is the answer. I shall put them to rest before their suffering can begin and make it so that God may cleanse them once they are in his arms. Yes, of course. I believe you now. There's only one way. How do I do it? Tell me. Please, 
Please, I, I will do anything, anything you ask. Of course, if I am to be free of this sin, then I must surrender myself to be cleansed of it. You may have me. Remove my will so that yours can be done in the name of redemption. Yes. I am at your disposal, my liege. 